another video and today will be your first cave video so there's I recommend you get about a stack of iron uh maybe, maybe a bit of one or two other things but you want plenty of iron and maybe one or two other things but no so set out and what you need to bring well first of all bring at least a stack of torches that is essential uh yeah i actually should bring some extra so you want to bring lots of torches and i recommend putting things on the right because the way minecraft works things always fill up on your left and then and that means that all the important stuff will be on your right and they won't be disturbed so i recommend bringing a bed you probably won't need it just in case but half a stack of wood like to create torches if you need crafting table just all the things it's just good to have i've already got a crafting table you don't really need that if you have wood like at least a stack of torches at least half a stack of food and plenty of building block i recommend cobblestone if you want to smelt something to maybe get iron armor midway but yeah actually i could keep these two furnaces actually i think i'll bring the furnaces actually i only really need to i can just put this up here so is that it i think so so cave i'm going to i know that 1.18 this is 1.18 it was actually 1.18 at the start that was my mistake but caves have completely changed so it's much different exploring them so i think i'm going to do it right it's not that thing there's a cave over there i believe and that's the one i think i'm going to today now i don't recommend going below y0 or try to stay around like y just don't you don't want to go too low so it's like right now your main goal is iron and that's most common at y16 except from when you find like mountains and things but if that's most common at y16 then i recommend staying around y30 that's my usual level when i'm caving but i'm not really sure where is this cave I swear there was one here, like not this one, like somewhere close. Come on, just break. Where are you? I, bro, I swear there was a cave here. Is it further along here? What? No. Oh. Yeah, don't question me, I know. I actually went up there without seeing it over here. Now, top tip. Always go along each hallway. It's not the easiest now in 1.18, but you want to light the bits around you before getting any ore. You want to light all the bits around you and some people say that I place torches too much, but it's, all, it's better lots than none. So light the place around you. This was much easier, of course, in the previous, before 1.18, pre-1.18, but you can still do it, and it's still relatively easy, but... But the good thing is that in 1.18 mobs it's a light level of zero to spawn, so that means no light whatsoever. So it does mean highly reduced spawn, so it isn't that bad yeah i've already burned through the, so many torches i think i'll i'll light up this area maybe get one up here actually and then i'll maybe come back and get all the ores but it might be quite annoying you might burn through a lot of torches but it's the best way if you don't want to be killed by a creeper Okay, ore, so we can go to start mining some ores now. I think, yeah. Actually, yeah, so I can just jump up here. Bro. Uh, try that again, maybe just here, that's better. Okay, so, I recommend you also get a, oh, seriously. 
uh, I recommend you also get about half a stack of coal. No, a stack of coal, sorry. So about a stack of iron and a stack of coal. That's what you want. Uh, this water. Let you there. No. Come on. Okay, screw this. I still get the coal, but it's not the nicest. Bro, where's this stuff coming from? Finally. Okay, finally done with that. Yes. Okay, iron here, that's nice and easy. Yeah. As I say, this is completely changed to 1.18, so it's completely different. It is like another way is that you can't really staircase up any more like you could in 1.18, but now, and also big recommendation: take your coordinates of the beginning of your cave. So I'm about minus 100 and zero. I just like to do it to the nearest 50 or so. Or 25, whatever's easiest for you. Okay. Where am I auto going? Something. Okay, okay, and I'm going to get all this ore here. It, in my opinion, caving probably the most boring part of Minecraft. Cause like, but well, all you really need to do is you can need it do a couple of times. Then once you've got iron farms, oh, it's so nice. Like for my setup of this Let's Play series, I want to defeat like the dragon by episode twenty-five. I don't want to rush it, and I want to set up lots of farms. This is going to be lots of teach how to do lots of farms. That's one of the main things of the series. Okay. We, yeah, we've got more iron over there. I'll take that and I'll take this coal as well. And what's this thing? It like, keeps this auto moving me. Is it broken? Like, bro, there's something wrong with bedrock. Yep, just lighting everything up. I know. Please don't roast me in the comment section. Like, yeah. I don't plan to get all the ores on film, I think I'm just going to, like after I'm just going to do a bit more since I don't really, it'll be quite a long video if I got all the ores that I said that I would, but this is a big coal vein, gosh. Uh, more iron, that's good. How much iron do I have? Eight, not that much when you think about it, not that much. Bro, what is it with this auto move thing? That's more iron. Uh, I could buy more iron down there, but I'm not sure. I don't really think you need copper. You can just ignore the copper completely, really. But anything coal like that, do not ignore. You want to get all of it as much as you can. Okay, okay, that's that. They're lighting up all that up. Okay, where did I see this? Oh, right down there. Easy. Good, nice vein. Not that much, but it's decent. Like, I recommend getting enough for a full set of armor and a full set of tools. And then after that, I recommend. I'm not sure, like, you could mine for it, like, just, like, branch mine or strip mine, whatever you want to call it, but, like, it's not as efficient, but it is safer, so, if you're really cautious and you just, you don't want to lose your world, then 
I'm fine with that. Okay, coal up there. I'll take that. And that's what the smallest part. I think I might have been here, I'm not sure. Oh, this is interesting. I know really I should be lighting the rest up. Actually, yeah, I probably will. Okay, that's that. Yeah, try to light everything up. That was just, I wasn't really following my own rules there, being a bit naughty. And this is where the wood is coming. If you don't have any wood in here, then, well, you're dead. Sorry, but if you can't craft another pickaxe, then you're gonna go back home. Another thing is that sometimes you can just put a chest down, put all your valuable things in it, and then record the coordinates, which can be very useful. Uh, sticks, stone pickaxe, good. I, I don't really want to spell in this video, I think I'll just waste a bit of time. But, I think I might stop a bit after this, but yeah, we'll see how it goes. Okay, good, nice vein. I don't think I have to worry about coal for a while now. And another torch. Yeah, I am a bit excessive. And I also highly recommend um, to, to once you've got enough iron for a set of armor, just do it. Just like get a set of armor and then continue because it's really good. Also, why not any coal veins? Because you sometimes get iron ones behind, and that's always nice. It's iron, like probably the biggest thing that you need here more important than coal and gosh this is a big vein yeah that's nice how much iron have i got 32 half a stack that's decent it's 24 for a set of armor i believe i think i'll go back because it says there's some other things that i've seen isn't there some yeah there's coal up there but Night time. Ooh, this is an issue. I think I'll get this coal. I think I might end it just soon after this and do the rest of camera since it's not really nice to have such a long video, is it? Yeah, you can always shift when you're mining up. That's something that you can do. Doesn't look like there's too many mobs though. Yeah, but I think I'll really I can run for it. I've still not moved to my other house yet because this is filming like literally like an hour after I completed it. I know, but I will soon, don't worry. Just so I can see, even though I know mobs can't spawn there, it's good to just... Yeah, that's better. Okay. Mining all of this. These coal veins can be huge. Gosh. Yeah, bed. I think I might actually just sleep. Like, you can sleep, that's why you should bring a bed. But I think I'm just going to sleep now and hopefully everything goes well. I've lighted up everywhere around me. So this should be fine. Please. Oh, good. You can always bring a clock, but... I recommend every now and again just putting your bed down and seeing if you can sleep, but only, it's a big only, if you've lighted up all the caves around you, otherwise it could end badly. Uh, yeah, very badly. Ooh, call up there, I'll take that. Okay, this is good. Yeah, looks like I'm in for another big vein. Uh, I could just see the tip of it. <sighs> yeah, I think I'll wait until a bit longer, but 
I don't really want to spend too long in here. I recommend once you've got about a stack of iron and at least maybe two stacks of coal. I really, yeah, you need more coal than that, about two stacks and they shouldn't be too hard to get as they come in huge veins. I think next episode I might just do like a wheat farm, like a nice wheat farm, not like the, that's the one that we have next to our base. No. Which is, should be fully grown actually. Yeah, it should be fully grown by now. And this bit here, can't forget you. Okay, there's not much left to do, so I'm pretty sure, yeah. That goes down like right to the end of the world. How far does this go exactly? Yeah, I'm shifting. Very far, so I think that's all we'll do today. I think I'll probably do a bit more off camera. But yeah, that's what I'm going to do. Okay. Hmm, yeah. Oh. Okay. Bit of a shock. Yeah. Actually, I should have just gone down here. I should have noticed this. Wait, where does this come from? Here. Okay, yeah, that makes sense. And yes, my wheat is ready to farm. I think I'll farm that, and next episode I will be moved in. Don't worry. Yeah. Okay, this is taking a while. Uh, drowned. I can hear drowned. Where are they? Uh, I think they're just anywhere. So I'll farm this and the sugar cane. Most of that's grown one, which is good. So yeah, how were you not grown yet? Unlike your brothers and sisters, you're a bad boy. And the top of a sugar cane, so sugar cane, it has to be one block away and it can only be placed on things like sand. So 21, I can plant a bit more actually, I think I will. So it only has to be one block away. No, why is it like that? Bro, why does it do this? Uh, then. I think that's the extent it'll get. I don't think I'll plant any more after this, but that's the sugar cane done. Yep. Go back here, get the wheat. Rest of the wheat. Nice. Get this. But, yeah. Like, I know it's not the best, but I guess if you... If you don't really have that many more, but say if you're in the forest and find a water source, this is probably your best start of the game, food. Okay. Seeds, yeah, now I can plant them. Yeah, I went a bit off track there, but I don't really care. No, one there. Um, seriously? You had to be different. Uh, yeah, I just won't plant this. I'll just plant this just in a sec since I love my hay and hoe over there, so I don't really want to craft another one. Okay, that's that, and I think that'll end today's episode. So by next episode, we will have moved into that house there, and yeah, hope you enjoyed. Bye.